What's going on, everybody? My name's David Braley. I'm a pro singer with 20 years of experience on stages all over the world. Tonight, I've got more Stray Kids. This time, I got the best thing for me, which is a live performance. I'm a huge fan already. I can't wait to learn a little bit more. Here we go. Dig that tune, that first, that uh, opening bit. Very cool. Yes. I love the musicality of this, man. It sounds so good. I really feel like what makes these guys super unique, and I know I've, I've, I say I feel like you guys kind of told me in the comments, but what makes these guys so unique is is the rap. I mean, the amount that they use uh, and, and, and how good they are, the musicality, making such a simple beat, they fill it up with the, with the, with the um, syllables and with the beats of their, mu their own music and the words that they choose, the lyrics that they write. I'm gonna, definitely going to have to give them, uh, give, give them both the, the poet, uh, also the unique, uh, uh, tick the unique box, because simply the rap and, and their, their, just, their unique flow, their style, it works, it's, it is unique, and um, man, I just love it. They're really, really smart about their lyrics and their placement of their lyrics with the beat behind it. Love it. Yeah. So larger picture. Let's take a look at the entire the entire stage. First off, look at the size of the stage. It's massive. The size of their screen. The screens alone are just extra sizes of the sides of the stage. It's amazing. Um, the lights, the the mood, the lighting, all working out real well. Setting the mood of this song. It's still um, the song is it's poppy. But it's 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 sending a really you know kind of a sad love song sort of vibe, and the lights and the setting and the way these guys are are are, are performing, the set and the tech all comes in together to make that entire picture and, and bring the audience along for the story. So definitely get tick in the technical box. They're definitely engaged with the audience. You could see it right here. It's amazing how I mean. So good. I mean, again, it's one of those things I, I don't want to easily compare it to something that has been done before but it is a relatively uh, a, a newer ver uh, a newer direction off of something we have had before which is the boy bands and to be honest with you it's not over yet the market uh, the marketability of these groups clearly are still is still there it's just finding the right ingredients i suppose and these guys here these guys they've got it i think they've definitely got it um you know i'm sold on it man 
Yeah, I love his voice. The uh, the bass. I was told before in a in a comment. Thank you for that. Appreciate that. But yeah, man, what a great voice. His accent is uh, really incredible, and it's very much. Um, he has that oomph behind it. That it's raw. It's gravel. It has that texture on there. So it's, that's really a nice addition to the group sound. Love it. These guys, their voices are really, really great. They rap and they sing just as well. Oh, playing it down. Have a feeling. Uh oh. Nice. See, that's that point where, like, the uh, as you saw, the entire group takes forward, steps forward, goes right to the edge of the stage. It's a fun little trick that you can do in moments like that when beats drop. You take that little extra step where you break the barrier before where you were, you were once had the fourth wall was kind of set back. And now all the lights inch forward. So it's almost like as if everything just comes closer to the audience. And it, it, it just adds another level for performance. It's a silly little trick, but everybody does it. I do it. It's, it is genuinely everywhere. And these guys did it with the beat drop. And it wasn't a huge beat drop, but it was enough where it just added that extra level to top off the ending of this tune that's so finely just developed you know it builds so well that and I got to be honest with you, too, that a lot of points, especially with live music, how much they are singing to a backing track, which there's doesn't seem too much of a band often, no matter where you are, there's usually a click, which is just tempo, something to keep the tempo for the live band, for the singers. And then they add something else, sweeteners and stuff, because you can't make the sound of comets and fires roaring while you're in a band in your standard band however with these extra things you could also add in little extra layers for vocals which in the states a lot of people do now what i understand is that this group is all self-produced i don't think they do that this much that much so what i'm going to say is basically these guys have such solid pitch and control that they're so perfectly in tune, you can hear them. You can pick out individual voices, yet you can still really only hear one tone because they blend and they listen together so well. That's a skill. That's huge. And I really, really dig that out of any group. Wow. That was really, really great. And I tell you what, these groups, they surprise me all the time. Everything's getting different. I'm not, I tell you what, I am not involved in any of the music scenes. So this is all brand new to me. And to be honest, some of it, it's oddly familiar because we have had, when I grew up, I'm not young but when i grew up we had the boy bands you know and that was the thing and this is oddly familiar to it um not and that's not a bad thing it's just saying that there are certain things that will continue and will forever work and be marketable and entertaining it's just about the ingredients clearly these groups the stray kids bts i think i got kbs somewhere out there that i've heard already i've already done um and they're just, they are that ingredients. They're the, 
per- they're 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 friendly looking. Their they their smiles are are happy. They make people happy. They're they're unassuming, but they're so talented. And um, yeah, yeah, they just they have that right batch that's gonna keep them around for a very long time. Well, thank you so much once again. I'm digging my journey into Stray Kids, and I'm looking forward to more. Have a great one, guys. Take care.